Who's up for a challenge? Who's up for a sandwich? Well, I'm up for both today. You've seen me review this Talk Motors Kratos R previously in a video and I've spent the day with it and I was very pleased with it. But what impressed me the most was its battery life. This Talk Motors Kratos R claims to get an IDC range of 180 kilometers and I'm about to test just that. I want to go get myself a sandwich in Panjgani and come back and we're going to see if this is going to be capable of doing it. So let's head on to the road, have a nice Saturday and check the Talk Motors Kratos R once again. So what are we trying to achieve here today? Well, we are trying to achieve the IDC range of the Kratos R, which is basically something that the engineers and professional test riders of Talk Motors have been able to produce in optimum weather conditions and at a certain constant speed and on a certain type of road. Now, in no way is this a real world representation of how customers will be using this motorcycle, but it will always be fun to know what is the real capability of the motorcycle. Especially in the hands of an amateur like me, so let's see what the Kratos R can do. Now the engineers from Talk Motors had told me to carry a constant speed of somewhere between 25 to 30 km an hour in order for the battery to come into its sweet spot and get the optimum amount of kilowatt hours which is basically KMPL for EVs. Now, the tricky part was we were headed to Panjgani from Pune and yes, most of the road is pretty straight but this test was being done in the heat of June and you encounter a guard section which will break our performance. So it was a test of how good it was at maintaining the speed and the range. Game on! So we have just taken a little break for refreshments and of course rejuvenating for the ride and we have almost covered halfway. We are 37 kilometers in and we've only dropped 26 kilometers of range from the 124 that is displayed. So we have gained 11 kilometers in uh, range and that is good news because uh, we should be gaining another 11 on the way uh, till our journey and that will be very crucial for our way back because we will need as much as we need on the way back because now we are pretty relaxed about range but I can see ourselves being very worried on the way back. So let's head on ahead and get ourselves our sandwich. So just giving you a little recap of the Top Motors Kratos R, it is an electric bike with uh, 4 kilowatt hours and 36 newton meters of torque. It is capable of doing 105 kilometers an hour, uh, but we are going to be cruising between 30 to 40 right now. I mean, we were given instructions to do 25 to 30, but uh, well, our young blood could not take that slow pace. So we are doing 35 to 40. but. The results should be the same since I am not giving quite a lot of throttle input at all. Uh, the road towards Panjgani has a combination of uh, uphills and downhills all across the entire highway. And uh, while uh, going downhill, I just coast and it cruises at maybe 35. Probably 18-20 kilometers away from our destination and uh, we've covered 70.5 kilometers but uh, it says that we have covered 50, we have lost 55 kilometers of range. 17 kilometers ish to go and I just can't wait for my sandwich now.
We somehow managed to cross the guard section relatively quickly, but we crossed it at the peak of heat. Moreover, the slope being quite aggressive, the bike chewed through a large chunk of its range in order to climb the slope. While we were riding on the highway on the way here, we got 21 watt hours per kilometer, which is a very decent number. We were getting 38 watt hours per kilometer, which is a hefty price considering the mission that we've got. But again, no need to worry. We can still make it up on the way back. So let's go enjoy our sandwich and come back. Okay, we are done with our lunch. We are refueled, but the bike has not been recharged. And to prove it to you guys, I will read out the Odo again. It says, as it did before, 52 kilometers range and we have covered 94.9 kilometers. Now time to head back. Once we left MAPRO, my negligence towards what the engineers had said was starting to pay its price. The bike had gone below 50 kilometers of range with more or less 80 kilometers to go. If I had listened to the engineers, this journey would have been possible but because of my excitement, we had to come up with some not so graceful methods to preserve the range as much as possible. So with the range dropping down to 1 km and us basically crossing the toll which meant we were back in the Pune region, we pulled over to talk how the journey had been. The Kratos R is a really impressive motorcycle with fun riding dynamics and can actually be an awesome urban machine. Now this test was purely for science and for your entertainment. We had multiple chances to recharge the bike like when we stopped at MAPRO but we didn't do it in order to see how close an amateur rider comes to the claimed IDC range of 180 kilometers. I've got news now. The battery has run out of juice but it's not the bike to blame. It's me. It was me being extra optimistic with uh, not listening to what the engineers of Talk Motors had to say. They had told me to maintain and to achieve that IDC milestone that we really wanted, the 180 kilometers, I needed to maintain the bike at 25 to 30 kilometers an hour. But as you can see in the clips, I was quite optimistic and I went, I mean, quite far away from that. I was doing 40, 50 kilometers an hour at a stretch. And, but still, we've covered 150 kilometers while I was doing my tom tomfoolery. And I also could have recharged at MAPRO while I was eating my sandwich but I chose not to to truly test this mileage and this range but this is a commuter bike and it's not meant to do long distances like this and the fact that it actually did one trip and a half back it's so commendable in fact I'm actually really happy with the amount of performance I got while riding the bike because it did not feel like I was uh, stretching the bike at all it was very comfortable at 40 and 50 and that's the exact same speed that you guys are going to be covering in the city with a city commuter like this so if you think about it mission successful question mark thank you so much for watching let us know what do you guys think of uh, the talk motors kratos r and would you guys like some more range tests like these on electric vehicles i'll see you guys in the next one it's been your boy bhavneet peace out